Celebrating Day of the Dead and hosting a big event this weekend. Cindy Brady Kupfer is standing by with all those <laughs> details. Hi, little Cindy. Yes, good morning from pregnant Cindy. Um, okay, so we're going out to Fairfield this morning because Dia de los Muertos is obviously a time where those in the Latino community honor the life of someone who has passed. And this is really a celebratory time. And you can take part in a big event that's happening tomorrow, Saturday, at the Fairfield Community Center. So we have Andrea Zerdia joining us live to talk more about what's going to be happening there tomorrow. So first of all, good morning. I understand you have a lot of people there to show us just a little sneak peek at what people can expect tomorrow. So what is happening in Fairfield? We are doing a lot tomorrow. So we have Ballet Folklorico, we have Mariachi, we have Aztec, dancer, Aztec dancers, and we have this beautiful community ofrenda where families from the community can come and place pictures of their past loved ones, which is really exciting. And then at the end, the Aztec dancers are actually gonna bless the ofrenda. We have free face painting, crafts, storytelling. We got a lot going on. And all of these different pieces are all traditional for Dia de los Muertos celebrations, right? These are all just different parts of how one can honor their, their loved ones who have passed. That is correct. Yes, we try to keep it as traditional as possible. Um, we do the papel picado, the, the flag making. We do the sugar skulls. We put food on the ofrenda with the baked bread and all that. So we try to keep it as traditional as possible. And tell me who is going to benefit from coming out. Is it all families of all ages? Do you necessarily need to uh, know someone who has recently passed? Or can you just come to celebrate those who want to be together in this time? Oh, no, we welcome everyone from the community. Fairfield has a really large Latino community, so we're, we welcome every age, every group. Um, come, whether you have someone who's passed or not, it's a great way to learn about the holiday if you haven't you know, learned about it before. Yeah, absolutely. And tell me more about these dancers. Are these local to Fairfield? Yes, the Fairfield Vacaville area. So these are our Ballet Folklorico group. They've performed for us at many events, but this one's very special, of course, to them. Um, so they're a group of about high, high school age, somewhere in there. Um, and they have, as you can see, the beautiful face painting today to celebrate the holiday. Wow, it is just beautiful to watch them. They're so elegant in the way they move with their dresses. Okay, well, Andrea, thank you so much. Again, this is happening at the Fairfield Community Center. Please give our thanks to the beautiful dancers this morning. Tomorrow, and it will go from 11 a.m. until 3 p.m., and that's over on Kentucky Street in Fairfield. You can honor those who have passed in the Dia de los Muertos celebration. All right, thanks, Andrea. Back over to you guys. Such a beautiful celebration. Mm -hmm. All right. Thanks, Dina.